Okay, so recently I bought Zack Snyder's version of the Justice League on DVD. And when I played it just earlier today, I found something quite odd. And I want to show you. So before I do that, I have to show you some stuff about my displays. This is a standard aspect ratio of 16.9. So that's just the representation of the height and width of a monitor without any measurements. Now, Zack Snyder's Justice League is filmed in 4x3. And I don't quite have a 4x3 monitor. Instead, I have this monitor, which is 5x4. So it's close, and I can prove that. This is the Zack Snyder's edition of the Justice League on HBO Max. And yeah, I have found a way to bypass DRM on OBS. Uh, I will make a video on that later, but you can see how there's just a little bit of wasted space at the top and bottom. That's because it's a it's a 5x4 monitor and not a 4x3 monitor. So that's to be expected. Now, look at what happens when I play the DVD I bought. Okay, I'm gonna have to do a jump cut here. But when I take that same image I had before, wait for it, just here, and I full screen, it does not really full screen. There is an enormous amount of wasted space here. And you can just see, it can very easily just be filled, but it's actually not. And the reason for this is because this is not a real 4x3 video. It's a crop of 4x3 within a 16.9 video. So if I swap back to my 16.9 video and full screen, it full screens just fine. And that's because these black bars are a part of the video itself. So I can prove this by changing the width of the window itself. So if the video truly were 4x3, I should be able to shrink the horizontal resolution of this window and make the black bars disappear. But that's not what happens. And I can prove that this is how it's supposed to work by pulling up a piece of media that truly is 4x3. Here is Neon Genesis Evangelion, the opening. And you can see if I reduce the video's horizontal resolution, the black bars disappear. That's because the video itself is actually 4x3, but with the Zack Snyder DVD, the black bars are literally a part of the video and not a result of it being displayed on a differently sized monitor. So this one, there are black bars here and I can reduce those black bars because the video itself is actually truly 4x3. But when I do it with the Zack Snyder cut of the Justice League, that does not happen. Yeah, that's it. Just slightly disappointed.